How do you make a lining for a hat? Well, you start off with a little oval for the tip and a sideband from your lining fabric. Now, I just drafted this tip oval based on the scale of the hat that I'm putting the lining into. And my sideband, in this case, is six inches tall and 25, no, 26 inches long with about a half an inch turn back one end. So I'm gonna lay the lining into the hat, whoops, with the opening at the center back, and I'll just pin it along here all the way around, and there'll be a certain amount of overlap wherever the back vent winds up. Now, I just have it pinned into place right now so you can see what it looks like before I cut it down. The next thing that I would do, look at the side profile of this, is trim down the parts of the lining where the hat sort of swoops down at an angle. I made it long enough for this longest part of the hat. Um, this is a custom lining fabric that I had printed at Spoonflower and I have my own millinery label in there, but if I'm making a hat for playmakers, I go and find some lining fabric from the remnant wall usually, and I put my playmakers character label and actor name label right here instead of this one that says La Bricolis.